Hey guys, welcome back. Houston Math Prep here. In this video, we're going to take a look at whole number addition models and strategies. Let's get that conversation started by talking about the concrete model for addition. Now the concrete model is typically the first thing we start with when we start talking with young children about how to add. It is concrete because we take actual objects or images of objects and we talk about counting them. So in this particular case, if we wanted to add two apples with three pears, we would encourage the children to count up how many pieces of fruit there are. So one, two, three, four, five. The concrete model uses the child's ability to count. As we get a little bit more advanced in the concrete model, we might use kind of more typical math manipulatives, like let's say base 10 blocks or just regular shapes. That kind of idea builds into our next model. Our next model is called the number line or measurement model. So this one moves away a little bit from counting objects and goes more towards adding together measurements, like maybe walking three feet and then walking five more feet. So we can model values on a number line. So here, for example, this is how we would model four. We have a line segment with the length four. At the end of that, we can add an additional line segment. This case, two. So now we're modeling four plus two. We can then either help children look at what number we have arrived at on the number line or draw an additional line segment and see how long that line segment is. So there, we're modeling addition, we're also practicing measurement. So let's see that kind of done ourselves. If we wanted to model three plus five, it doesn't matter which order we go in, so we'll just go in the order things are written. We can start, if we don't wanna do number lines, we can also do hops. So we can do one, two, three hops, landing us at the number three, plus now we're gonna start there and we're gonna do five hops. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're going to look at, all right, once we added in those five hops, where did we land? Well, we landed at eight. So our number line model allows us to either work with measurements or get the idea that addition moves us to the right on our number line model. Okay, so now that we've got a couple different models, we can also start to talk about strategies that we may cover with young children as we're teaching whole number addition. Now I've got this graphic here with uh, counting on fingers. I really want to encourage you never ever to discourage someone from using their fingers. They're the best manipulative because they're always with us. So we can certainly count on fingers. But when we talk about addition, the idea of counting on is the idea of starting at one number and counting from that number up to your total. So for example, if I want to model four plus seven, I would have students find the larger number starting at seven and count on from seven. So starting at seven, either on a number line or on their fingers or maybe even out loud, and then I'm going to count on four more numbers. So I'm going to go 8, 9, 10, 11. So I started at the larger number 7 and I counted on four more to land at 11. So that idea of starting at 1 and counting up however many jumps is the counting on strategy. Another strategy that we want to emphasize with students for addition in whole numbers is the strategy of making 10. We can start with working with students with manipulatives, again, kind of going back to that concrete model. So recognizing that one block and nine blocks makes 10 blocks and so on. 
We can also be doing kind of the same thing with a number line method, but just recognizing that one and nine make 10, two and eight make 10, three and seven, four and six, five and five. We wanna recognize these pairs of numbers. So especially as we move forward into adding lots of numbers together, we can find these make 10 pairs. Eventually we want to move to kind of the more symbolic addition using the actual addition sign, not necessarily having any models, but still recognizing that one and nine make 10, two and eight make 10, three and seven, four and six, five and five. All right guys, that does it for this video on an introduction to addition models and strategies. To see more from us, Catch you in the next video.